28 Valkyries. Do you want to hear all their names? I don't think we have time. <laughs> all right, now then, I'm going to give you just a little background here. A little Bruni here is the head of the Valkyries. And uh, she has, uh, well, I found some of her resolutions too, and I thought maybe I would just share them with you. She, first of all, she's required to wear a, a Victoria's Secret dress plate. And usually her hair is Clairol number 201 beige blonde. And uh, she's, but you know, she comes across as really mean, but she's actually daddy's little girl, all right? But she does have this Joan of Arc complex, and let me explain. Um, she, well, at her husband's um, funeral, she's sort of considered a pyromaniac. Um, she accidentally set fire to the entire world which could cause a little bit of a problem uh, for the environment. And she, uh, she decided uh, that maybe she had to make up for some of her indiscretions. So she, decided, she devised a three-part plan to correct this. First, to, to fight water pollution, she's going to order the Rhine maidens to get out all of their junk out of the bottom of the Rhine and relocate to the aquarium in Queens. Okay. <laughs> Now next, to fight the noise pollution, she's just simply ordering the Valkyries to knock it off. Okay, so it goes on a long time. And finally, for her own contribution, she's going to fight air pollution by giving up sleeping on a fire-surrounded rock. And she's just going to buy a space heater like everybody else. and it's an hour and 20 minutes of this kind of fun and frivolity that I do around the country. 
So if you ever see it advertised, I hope you can come and attend because it is a fun show. Thank you so much for being here this evening. And I'm going to go take my little bird off my head. I think he's hungry. And I will be happy to meet you all in the lobby in a few minutes.